Transshipment is the activity of moving goods from one ship to another. In this contest, however, the practice is occurring between the Chinese managed industrial trawlers and canoes in Ghanaian waters. According to the London based Environmental Justice Foundation, its investigations suggest that in 2017 alone, industrial trawlers transferred around 100,000 metric tons of fish to specially adapted canoes illegally. The data calculate that the catches were worth 41 to 51 million dollars at sea with much of the money flowing into the hands of mostly Chinese fishing companies out of the country. Ghana's total industrial catch for the year 2017 was 167,000 metric tons. Cycle accounted for 100,000 tons of that, meaning just 40% of trawler catches landed legally. The Ministry of Fisheries and Aquaculture Development in 2014 set out a five-year development plan in its fisheries management plan to address some challenges in the fisheries sector. The goal of the five-year plan was to rebuild fish stocks to enhance the socio-economic conditions of fishing communities, create employment with national and international frameworks and standards, and improve food security as well as contribute to GDP and foreign exchange earnings. Though the plan is expected to end in December 2019, little of that is yet to be achieved, according to Far Banbo, a partner of the EU working to improve the fishing sector in the coastal areas of the western and central Central regions. The illegal fishing methods adopted by the Chinese vessels has reportedly forced some local fisher folks to abandon their canoes in search of other jobs. Some fishermen at Salt Pond and Kafo spoke to City News about the negative impact of these foreign vessels on their operations. <laughs> Women who are part of the fisheries business chain are equally concerned. <laughs> Zonal Director for the Fisheries Commission in the Infantiman Municipality, Kwame Damwa, says the commission is currently working with some security agencies to monitor the activities of the Chinese trawlers in the cycle business. He added that the commission will, from August 1 to September 30, 2019, observe a close season for industrial trawlers as was done for artisanal fishers in May 2019. What the Fisheries Commission is doing now is that as a uh, part of the management measures, we are uh, from 1st of August to 30th of September, we observing a close season for the industrial trawlers, just as what they did in uh, May June. But the industrial trawlers are going to uh, be off sea for two months. We're just doing this as part of a management measure to ensure that our sea will be revived with the depleted uh, fish stocks. However, they've complained about the activities of these industrial trawlers. 
for now, as I speak to you, the MCS or the Monitoring Control Surveillance Division of the Fisheries Commission is having a gadget that is monitoring their activities. So now they don't actually come within the zone.